Local school districts are reacting to the news from the governor that the next school year could potentially begin as early as July. Governor Newsom made the suggestion yesterday to try to make up for the lost learning during the pandemic. Our Andrew Nomura spoke to some of those districts today and he joins us live now from Linda Vista with what they had to say. Andrew. Well, Andrew, some of those school leaders that we spoke to say that that news comes out as a huge surprise, a surprise that comes with a lot of questions. Starting the school year as early as July or August is now at the center of conversation after Governor Gavin Newsom proposed the idea on Tuesday in hopes to reclaim lost time because of the coronavirus pandemic. An idea school leaders say comes as a surprise. San Diego County Office of Education's Chief of Staff Music Watson sent us this statement basically stating the office hasn't received any official guidance from the governor or state school leaders, but they are advising county schools and and districts to prepare for any scenario, including the governor's idea. My cell phone was lighting up with text messages from, you know, from Northern California all the way to here in San Diego um, saying, wait, what did he just say? Christine Peck with Poway School says as of right now, the district doesn't see starting in July as a likely option. Start date is still set for mid-August. She says a school year calendar is far too complex to change on a dime. Our um, teachers and families have expressed that they need a break. Distance learning has been hard. A lot of them want and need a summer. She says there are still so many questions and not a lot of answers. First and foremost, the health and safety of our staff and students. And then when we do come back, what does that look like? You know, what's the new normal when it comes to school? Well, Peck says that there have been some recommendations that have been brought up. Nothing solid as of yet. Still a lot of questions that need answers, and hopefully we'll have those answers soon. For now, we're live here in Linda Vista. I'm Andrew Nomura, Fox 5 News.